hello again friends welcome back to my channel good to see you again today my name is still sharon and if you're just meeting me for the first time welcome god bless you so much for clicking on the video again today to hear what the lord would have us know i have this exciting word for someone today because i've taken mine and i pray that you believe yours and um, see the lord bring it to pass yes this word came to mind in the book of i'm going to read it to us in the book of first king 2 19 and um, it says, <laughs> oh, please, please, please. God is about to surprise someone. God is about to shock you. God is about to do something for you that no man, no man can take glory for. Today it says, and Bathsheba said, well, I will speak to thee. I will speak for thee, for thee unto the king. This is a human assuring someone that she will speak to the king for him. And immediately it came to mind when I saw that scripture and the Lord said, but my children do not believe me when I tell them I will send someone, I will speak to someone, I will lead someone to them. It is easier for us to believe human because we see them all the time. But God's word is more powerful than anyone. God is the one that would put your helper to a sleepless night until they remember you and favor you. God is the one person that will lay your thoughts in the heart of someone until they look for you and find you. And today he's told me to remind you. Yes, your brother might have told you, your sister might have told you, yes, they will help you get this connection, they will help you get this thing done, but he has brought me here today to remind you that he's about to stir the heart of someone for your sake. Believe this if you have never believed anything on this channel before. The Lord is about to stir the heart of someone for your sake. From unimaginable quarters, by the way, from places you least expect. Oh yes, it might even be someone you have never met. But the Lord is about to stir the heart of someone for your sake. He said, tell my child, tell that one person that would hear you and believe that I am sending someone to them and I, God, will put your thoughts in the heart of that man, that woman, that person, that office, that institution to do the will that I have proposed for you. This word is for you. If you're hearing this right now, get ready. Stay expectant. They will come to you. They will come to you. This is a human, Bathsheba, saying, I will speak of thee to the king. How much more your father, who holds the whole world in his hand, who has the heart of a king is in his, in his hand, is saying to you today, he's going to put your thoughts in the heart of a man that cannot resist doing what he has asked you of him to do for you and that will bring you joy that will bring you fulfillment that will bring you settlement that's the three words that came to my mind joy fulfillment settlement joy fulfillment settlement god is about to bring something that will cost you joy fulfillment settlement and he's raising a man he's raising a man he's putting it in the heart of that man and the man will find you if men mortal can tell you, I will do this, your God is reminding you today that he can do much more. Be expectant. That's your word for today. Be expectant. It's going to give you joy, fulfillment, and it's going to open you up to another dimension of greatness. In the mighty name of Jesus. This is your word today, someone. I've, I've taken mine. Trust me, when I heard it for myself... Oof, I believe it. <laughs> I believe it. And the God we serve is not a God that says what he doesn't mean. And he's not a man that he should lie. If he has said it, he will make it good. God bless you again, friends. God bless you so much. I'll see you again in my next video. Bye-bye.